Hi there. Good day. My name is Akinyo Oke. I'm the CTO of Remsoft Online Exam Simulation. And my goal is to tell you about OES and how we feel we should be uh, we should be uh, one of the people that should win uh, the hundred thousand dollars. In 1988, I was just like 11 years old, and um, I had an issue with my mathematics, and my dad hired the service services of uh, one uh, old man, formerly a headmaster of the school. And today, I've never remained the same, because the way the man taught me, I, I wish this solution is available to capture everything how he has taught me so he can put this in almost all the people, all the young people in Nigeria. And this, is, this has actually inspired me to date. If you look at the likes of Omolewa and uh, Professor Je uh, Jekede and uh, Professor Walishu Inka, these are notable people in the community. These are notable people in Nigeria. How many of their content, how many of their content has been captured also? So you can see it is a big problem in the country. It's a big problem in education. And that is why we are saying that we need an investment. We need somebody who can actually, we need a grant that can help us kickstart this thing on a big scale to reach out to all the teachers in the country. So I've mentioned a bit out of, uh, I mean, a bit about the, 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 the problems that we're facing. Now it's tough for people to make a living. This will help them. If they have been able to capture their content, this is one of the things we intend to do. Because students, whether we like it or not, we try, we watch. The pedagogy has changed, and people want to actually view. They are always on their TV, on their computer, or on their on their phone, as compared to the traditional mode. And most especially, AI is also introduced. How can we benefit? How can we benefit from all these devices? And that is why we has come to play. We help with intention of knowledge, we help with the other visuals, we help with uh, gender equity, uh, equality in, in education, and so on and so forth. But what is actually OES? What is that product that helps it? OES is an LMS system, an enterprise LMS system that can house all this product. LMS is learning management system. So, and OES feeds on peer, what we call peer. That means performance of, of the education in whole, evaluators, I mean evaluation of the evaluators, and assessment of the, t of the student, and reporting back to all the stakeholders with data analytics. That is what is contained in OES. So why invest in OES? For scalability? for revenue generation, revenue stream generation, global reach to be able to meet up with the SDGs, SDG4, and uh, other SDG goals, and I demand to be able to meet education I demand. Of course, improve quality of education also. So these are areas in which, these are the channels in which you can actually see OES right now. We've been able to build a mobile application that can do both online and offline because of our popularities in Africa. We have a web channel, we have everything is managed, we have a desktop channel and we have a telecom. But the telecom part is not yet out, but this is one of the things we are actually looking at. And some are out, but we've not been able to implement it because of funding. So our markets, our customer segment goes into power. Uh, individual student in any area, any sector that does anything that has to do with education. It goes into the basic school education, 
secondary school, university, small scale acquisition center, and we feel with your involvement, we will be able to achieve our goals by helping education in the country. We have quite, quite some tractions. We have five million grants. I, I won't be mentioning most of it, mo most of this, uh, but we last year we were able to raise like six million turnover. We are able to get like six million turnover, which has helped uh, help the products to improve. But as the money comes in, we throw it back into the business. And uh, we're looking at the uh, customer in different areas, such as parent, which is a, a parent that indirect customer, uh, the student that direct customer, the teacher, but we are focusing on the teacher right now. Teacher, we are focusing on the teacher because they are not attended to. And schools, of course, and others, as you can see, on the screen. We intend to just target 200,000 users, which will give us like 2 million, and which we can equate to like 2 million if we do the exchange rate at 100, 100 uh, uh, <coughs> 10,000 10, naira per, per, uh, per dollar. No, what I know, which if you look at it, we, we can achieve, uh, you know, 200,000, which should give us like $2 million at what rate? At 10,000 per, per, per user per year. And what we, and how we intend to grace that money is via the subscription uh, revenue model, transitional revenue model, and uh, ad-based. When we have a community, we, now in, we, we start with the ad-based uh, part of the business. We feel we can achieve this. And our business model is gonna be the B2B or B2C or B2B2C, but we captured it at B2B2C. And sometimes with the government, if they wanna actually uh, get this for the old state government, it has the facilities to aggregate you know, schools and teachers on it. These are our board of directors. They are well known in the community. They are people who are the, sh the shakers of the community. They've given, they've been given advice for the past uh, five to six years. But the business was kick-started with uh, Mrs. Omolola as well as uh, Ralph Suna. What we're just looking for is $100,000 that will help us to start up a center to create content and reuse OES to distribute or to distribute, disseminate this, uh, this knowledge to the people in the surroundings, in the community. Within, with just 10,000 naira per year. And we feel that we'll be able to realize 25% projection growth while scaling to other while scaling to other continents other countries in the continent this is our expense model and this is what we intend to use the money on uh, content digitalization and training centers for teachers rent and service expansion server expansion because that's key the more people come on the server the more we need to expand it operations and research and deployment expense and salary and commission, that's very important. Salary and commission expense, because that will help with our, you know, with our sales. Thank you, and God bless.